What's going on everybody? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm back here again with another sports card collecting and investing video. And today I'm going to be going over uh, some of the stuff that I'm going to be sending off to PSA. Um, you know, the last submission, I was very, you know, motivated by the results. I think, you know, I did very well. And I'm glad that, you know, I was able to capture that for you guys. And uh, the reaction was really, you know, I, I was blown away. I never thought I'd get that many Gem Mint 10s. Honestly, on my first submission, I thought I was going to make some mistakes. So I want to, you know, go over some of the cards that I'm uh, going to be sending off to PSA as well as, you know, why I'm sending these off. You know, some of this stuff is because of the hype this year. As well as uh, I think next year, you know, these players can end up, you know, getting a big surge. Uh, before we do get started, you know, if you are brand new to this channel, make sure you do subscribe, like this uh, video, as well as commenting on the video and letting me know what you think, as well as letting me know what you guys are sending off to PSA and uh, how long your turnaround time, anything like that. Uh, follow me on Instagram as well. You know, like I said, I put out about, you know, two to three videos a week as far as on YouTube. I post on my story almost every day about sports card market trends, anything about the sports card markets, players that I'm looking at. So feel free to follow me on Instagram. Like I said, uh, you know, the support is appreciated. Uh, so without further ado, guys, you know, we're gonna go ahead and get started. I got here probably over 150 cards and uh, some of them are gonna be going in on like 15, 20 day submission. So that's $20 a card. And then some of them, uh, I'm going to be sending them off in a 45 day submission. So I probably won't be seeing these cards for about, you know, six months or so. Some of them maybe two, three months, but then the other ones I won't be seeing for maybe, you know, early next year or so like that. But, uh, you know, I think that, you know, by the time next year starts, the NBA season will hopefully be going on. And, um, you know, I'm not only submitting NBA, I got some football cards, MLB, soccer. So I'm very excited to go ahead and show you guys. So let's go ahead and check it out. Alrighty guys, so uh, I got a good amount of cards here that I'm going to be sending off. Like I said, I'll be doing a 20 day bulk submission as well as a 45 day bulk submission. So I'm going to go ahead and get started here. Um, you know, I, it takes, you know, a good amount of time to prep these. Um, probably within the last four or five days, I've been up, you know, for about an hour late at night, just looking over these cards, checking out the surface, looking at the corners, edges, all that good stuff and just prepping them and making sure that they are PSA ready. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started here. I'm gonna set these off to the side. These are the, the newest ones that I have pretty much looked over within the last few days. Um, and these, these is my, this, this right here is gonna be my uh, personal collection that I'll be sending off. These will probably be a 45 day. Uh, I'm a big Miami Heat fan, as you guys know. So I, I think Casey Akpala next year will get some playing time. Uh, if you guys don't know too much about him, you know, go watch his tape. He's not, you know, I, I don't know what he's gonna pan out to, but you know, uh, with the way that the market is, you know, you, you drop 15 points, you get like a 2x surge. So you never know. Maybe his, uh, right now his base prisms are about three, five bucks each. Maybe someday they're, you know, 15, 20 bucks. So, uh, you know, I got one, two, three. These are uh, three silvers that I'm going to be sending off. I got his auto right here. I got some select. Uh, this is the tie dye. I got a white select numbered of 149. I don't know if you guys can see that. Yep. Uh, I got a red court side T Maw, gold court side T Maw. I got another red one. That one's not numbered. And then I got a scope. And then uh, Bam at a bio. Very big on Bam, Bam at a bio, as you guys know. I got his uh, two rated rookies, two uh, three rookie king inserts. He's a purple one, the lime green one, which is numbered out of 149. And then I got a bunch of base prisms. These I'll actually be sending in on the 20 day. So I got one, two, three, four five six seven eight nine base prisms and a green prism i'll be sending those off so um you know i'm, I'm pretty excited to send those off uh, bam has been playing pretty well i'm very content with that next to your guys i'm gonna show you guys some tyler hero um you know these probably will be going into 45 day like the don russ nba hoops that i have in here so uh you know we got tyler hero two don russ rated rookies here's an instant impact silver insert i got an nba hoops base uh, here's the NBA debut orange mosaic reactive. Then I got, you know, a bunch of base mosaics. Um, those, those will probably be going on a, uh, on a 45 day submission. And here we go here. More of this, more of this stuff will be going in the personal collection. Like after Tyler hero, like the Jimmy Butler stuff and bam. Uh, so here we go. Tyler hero two select premier levels, blue velocity. This is the fanatics base optic. One, two, two uh, prisms. Here's some select base concourses. I'm going to be resubmitting this, as you guys saw in my last PSA submission. 
this didn't hit the minimum grade of a nine. So I'll be resubmitting that. Uh, and then next here, we got some Jimmy Butler stuff. This is going to be going to the personal collection. So um, anything Jimmy Miami, I'll be sending off as a 45 day submission. So I probably won't be seeing these for a while. Come back. Uh, Optic Hollow. This is a lime green numbered out of 149. This is a court side uh, T Maw. This is numbered out of 49. I got some die cuts, the blue die cuts. These are numbered out of 249. I like to get the, you know, serial numbered stuff. Here's a, some light blue. This one is numbered out of 299. Yep, 299. So there's that for Jimmy. And then I got the same one right here again, numbered out of 299. Same one. Uh, this is some Bam at a Bio second year stuff. Uh, they, these are numbered. I got the numbered stuff mostly. Um, that I'll be sending out two nine numbered out of 299. This is the choice. It's not numbered, but super short printed. Here's the uh, blue neon, I believe, something like that. This one's numbered out of 175. So here's a neon green. This one's actually numbered out of five. Only five in existence. Uh, select. I love these select. Here's the tie dye. Uh, not tie dye. What's it called, man? Uh, man, it's on the tip of my tongue. Not tie-dye, it's... I'll come back to it, it'll probably come back to me. Uh, here's a fast break or disco, however, however you wanna call it, disco there. And uh, I got a bunch of die cuts that'll be going into the personal collection. This one here is serial numbered out of 249. Um, here's a purple one, this one's serial numbered out of 99. Here's another blue one, serial numbered out of 249. Here's another red one, num serial numbered out of 175. This is a uh, this is a tie dye. I know that for sure. Um, and this is numbered out of 25. These are the uh, optic here, pink velocity, numbered out of 79. The scope. These are numbered out of 249. I got three of those. Here's an orange, numbered out of 199. And the checkerboard, super short printed, and the uh, optic hollows. And this is a, a mosaic blue. This one's actually numbered out of 99. Um, so, you know, I'll be submitting some of those. Those, like I said, be going to the personal collection. Um, and then make sure, guys, you know, once you submit your stuff, you know, I'm going to just go over this. Make sure you have a team bag. So that way, you know, you can fit a couple cards in. I'm going to just use one card as an example. Put the team bag, you know, just remove it. Um, just so you don't get any dust or lint in the card, you know, whenever it's on its on, in transit. So uh, make sure you guys buy team bags. You can get either the graded bags or the regular team bags. Um, just use those so that, you know, when they're in transit, you know, nothing ends up happening to them. Uh, Cause you know, you don't want them to get to the grader and then, you know, there's fingerprints and stuff on them or not fingerprints, but you know, dust and lint and, you know, it hits the surface. So next guys, uh, this is some stuff here, players for next year. Uh, Stephen Curry, I think, you know, this is the first year mosaic. I had a bunch of other ones, but I ended up selling them raw. I, th I think Stephen Curry mosaic stuff, you know, I don't think it's going to be like super expensive, but you know, maybe if this is a PSA 10, maybe an $80 card or something, uh, not bad. You know, Stephen Curry, he's up there as, you know, one of the most influential players of this generation. So I think his stuff will continue to go up over time. I got a KD first year Nets uniform, Optic, Brooklyn, uh, Kyrie, Pink Hyper. Uh, AD, you know, if they end up winning that championship this year, first year Lakers uniform, this one's off-centered, so, you know, I'm expecting like a PSA 9 or something. Surface is clean, though. Uh, here's a Disco Fast Break. These are nice. Uh, you know, I, I think hopefully this is a 9 or a 10. Uh, Kawhi, first year Clipper stuff. Um, you know, two mosaics. I got the Disco, the Fast Break, however you want to call it, and then the green. I got a base LeBron. My house, give and go, MVP LeBron, and then Trey Young second year stuff. Uh, these I'll be sending in probably I don't know yet, sec 20 day or 45 day. I think the second year Trey Young stuff is gonna go up just like Luca did uh, this year. So I got a pink hyper, blue velocity, uh, premier uh, concourse. Here's uh, premier, and then the base prisms, the base prisms. That's like six there. Here's a red, white, and blue. Uh, you know I think like I said I think Trey Young stuff is gonna go, um, you know pretty. Pretty in demand next year as far as first and second year stuff. Oh, hang on, I missed this pile right here. Uh, here's another one, green. Here's a, a mosaic base. I think his base mosaic stuff's gonna go up as well. Anthony Simons, silver prism 2018. You know, uh, 
this this card i think psa 10 is like 150 or so it could be more last time i saw it you know i don't i, I thought anthony simons was going to play a little more in the playoffs this year unfortunately they didn't give him too much playing time uh luka Doncic first year mosaics uh these are just base second year optic base you know i i, I think those are a good buy um yeah so that's that's that for that pile all right, here we go. Jason Tatum, my house. I like the my house inserts. So, um, you know, I think th this can go up over time. And uh, Kyle Guy, I'm pretty, pretty big on him. I don't think he's going to be like this great superstar, but, you know, uh, think of, you know, Duncan Robinson cards this year with Miami. I think Kyle Guy next year will be having some playing time with the Kings. And, uh, you know, if he goes out there, drops three threes a game, gives you 10 points a game or something, you know, his cards can go in demand. I mean, Duncan Robinson cards are in demand, and I never, I never thought that was going to happen. Uh, and I'm a Heat fan. Uh, John Morant and Don Russ. Uh, two, well, here's a Bowl Bowl Select Concourse. Here's another Kyle Guy. Kevin Porter Jr. I like, I'm very big on Kevin Porter Jr. I like his confidence. He's very, he's very, uh, very confident. He plays very smooth, calm, and collective. And I, I like his game. Uh, purple optic blue velocity here's a uh, on card auto optic uh, select concourse another base optic a base mosaic base optic colin sexton you know he he did pretty good last year he averaged 20 points and uh cleveland was just awful i think uh his stuff will go up hopefully next year i got uh four base optics i got these for like three bucks a piece so you know one psa 10 maybe 60 70 bucks could be even more i don't even know how much his market is right now Cam Reddish, uh, Pink Hyper, I pulled this myself. Maybe a PSA 9, PSA 10, $40 card, $70 card, who knows? You know, I, I think uh, kind of, you know, where I'm saying $40, $70 cards, you know, you don't want to expect too high on the profit. You know, you kind of want to limit yourself and be like, okay, well, maybe I can settle and just sell this card for 30 bucks. And uh, if you pulled it yourself, you know, you have no loss. You just spent the grading fees and, you know, there's a turn on investment of uh, 30 40 dollars there john collins uh like i said earlier in some of my videos i think the uh, hawks can make some moves and make a playoff push next year so his revolution this is the groove revolution parallel so i like that one john collins uh select concourse two of those michael porter jr finally coming alive in these playoffs two uh concourse and a premier level as well as a Zion Williamson base uh, prism. I do need to get more uh, Zions because uh, I think I think Zion's gonna, gonna come back really good next year. I think uh, he's hearing some of that noise. Uh, next guys, soccer cards. You know, I got uh, this uh, first year 2006 World Cup, Messi. Super off-centered, hopefully a near mint eight or a PSA nine. On the soccer cards, I don't even think I'm gonna put minimum grades. I think soccer cards are here to stay. And uh, I think that the uh, soccer market is not going to be in, as infatuated with PSA 9s as we are in the basketball and football market. Uh, Eden Hassards, got four of those here. And here's the red I showed you guys on my last video. Marcellos, Messi Optic, and uh, Patrick Mahomes, second year uh, Prism. PSA 10, I saw the other day sell for like 600 bucks. I, I got this at the flea market for $10 and uh, it was super mint condition. So uh, I have to go ahead and submit that and, you know, hopefully it comes out pretty well. Third year Mahomes, base prism. I think Mahomes is on that level where, you know, he's he's just base prism. Any any year I think will just be like $80 a PSA 10 or more. Like maybe his fifth year will be like $100 for a PSA 10. I just think he's got that uh, star power already. Drew Locke, uh, hopefully he ends up painting out well. I, you know... I think I should have submitted this like last month because the football season is about to start. So he's got a lot of hype going into him. He played pretty well last year in the games that he played. So maybe a PSA 9, PSA 10. Luis Robert. Uh, this is just the base uh, tops chrome. Bo Bichette. This is the pink refractor. And here's the refractor of Bo Bichette as well. Pretty big on Bo Bichette. I like his game. Okay. So there's those. And uh, these I've been trying to get out for a while but i've just been procrastinating so here we go we got a tops tech Derek jeter uh, i think this will be going into my personal collection i've had this for a while you know it's one of those acetate cards and it looks really good for its age uh, maybe a psa 9 you know it's not going to be worth much maybe like a 30 dollar card if, if it's a psa 10 
Um, you guys know about baseball, so much demand in baseball, so much, so many sets in baseball. So it's not like this is gonna be a $180 card or something. Dwayne Wade, tops draft pick. I got this at the flea market as well, guys. $8, mint condition. Uh, you know, rookie card and uh, one of my favorite players. So probably going to the uh, PC, very off centered, you know, maybe a PSA nine. Uh, Bam at a bio. NBA hoops, here's about six of those. Here's a te uh, teal explosion or blue explosion, something like that. It's not numbered. Panini status, blue velocity, purple optics. These are not numbered, but uh, you know, I've had these for a while. I need to submit these. So I've been stalling on submitting some of some of the stuff. Here's some other Bam at a bio. Uh, select two rookies, uh, another base prism. Here's second year. These are second year silvers. One, two, here's more base. Oh, uh, I need to organize these. Wow. Uh, let's see. This is a uh, pink cracked ice, red, white, and blue here. And let's see here. We got a silver, more second year silvers, a jaw debut, jaw hoops, Lonzo, the rookies insert, Mahomes second year optic, base, Gardner Minshew, Jason Tatum, red cracked ice, I like this uh, Kevin Garnett, uh, 2008 Topps Chrome. I'm a big fan of this set, 2008 Topps Chrome. I'm a very big fan. I gotta change out the penny sleeve, but uh, I'm a very big fan of this set. I love the old way that the that the uh, team was right there, and the the quality of the 2008 Topps Chrome is just beautiful. Uh, we got Shea Gill just first year OKC hyper hyper pink Kobe uh, last year Prism. LeBron, face mosaic. Here's the uh, LeBron Kobe freshman season. You know, the insert with Kobe guarding LeBron, not LeBron guarding Kobe. So those are those are really nice. I'm hoping to get those out. Uh, next here in another set, we got Kyle Guy again. Genesis mosaic, uh, on-card auto, optic, purple too, not even base. Luka Doncic second year cards. Second year pink ice. Um, we got this second year hyper pink. We got uh, second year purple optic. I just think Lucas stuff is gonna go insane next year. He's gonna have a lot of. I, I think next year Luke is gonna have a lot of national TV games. Um, you know, he he had a couple this year, but based on what the media saw this year with Luca in the playoffs, that you know they gotta have this guy on national TV more next year. Uh, second year select. Base Prism, Base Prism again, Will to Win, Mosaic, Luminance, Rookie. I got an Elite, these are from Chronicles. NBA Hoops Winter, these have been going up and up lately. Uh, LeBron, Winter Stays, Purple Hollow, another Purple Hollow. And then here's some more Base Mosaics. These PSA 10s on the Base Mosaics are like 150. Uh, here's the MVPs. I think I think the MVPs will go up more than the Base Mosaics. Uh, two, two other uh, pink, uh, pink camos. Yep, so there's that stack right there. And then I got one more stack for you guys. Like I said, this is gonna be a big submission. A lot of stuff going out in bulk. Second year Jason Tatum, Silver Prism. Here's another LeBron My House. One of my favorite cards. LeBron, Kobe, Topps Chrome. Um, hopefully a PSA 9, it looks really good. So, you know, I'm hoping for that. Uh, 2008, this is the Topps LeBron card. Um, these have been going up a lot in value, you know, the uh, the chalk powder toss. This is the tops. This isn't tops chrome. Tops chrome is expensive. Bow bowl, base prisms. Here's a uh, optic hollow. Another Kevin Porter Jr. Uh, prism. Teal explosion. Another bam. Tyler Hero choice. Uh, more base Tyler Heroes. Here's a silver select. Uh, tie dye. I, I forgot the name of this. This isn't tie dye. I know it's not tie dye. Uh, wow, I, I really forgot the name of this. I think it's like multicolor. It could be tie dye. I know it's not tie dye though. Uh, tricolor. There we go. Tricolor. The tricolor. It just came to me. Yeah, tricolor. Tyler Hero Select. These went up. I, I picked up a lot with tr the tricolor and his silver select with a bunch of uh, concourse base. For like 40 bucks. The other day I looked at sold listings of the tricolor. The, the tricolor was like 86 bucks raw. I couldn't believe that. Uh, variation base. I got a variation disco, uh, pink camo, green mosaic, orange reactive, and a De'Aaron Fox NBA hoops. 
So uh, a lot of good stuff in here, guys. You know, let me know in the comment section what you guys think. Tell me what card uh, you guys think has the most, you know, gain for upside. I'm very excited about the Tyler Hero cards, um, especially the BAM second years for my personal collection, as well as, you know, the Jimmy Butlers and stuff. But uh, let me know in the comment section what you guys think. That's pretty much going to wrap it all up for today, guys. Um, we're going to see you on the next video. Make sure you comment, like, subscribe, and we'll see you guys on the next video. Take care.